What is up guys? Welcome back in Justice 2. If you saw the last video, man, it's certainly been a long time since I played this and one of my favorite parts about this game was collecting the gear and collecting the gear sets. So I guess to commemorate that and to have those memories again, we are going to go through the top 10 best gear sets that I think at least look the best. Y'all have to let me know in the comments if I left any of your favorites out. Before we jump into the top 10, let me just say this does only include the five piece gear sets. Not the four, the three, or the two. I wanted to include only the ones where all five pieces were a part of the set. Now, if you saw again the last video, I am only missing two pieces out of the entire epic gear in the entire game and that includes one set to Wonder Woman and one set to Starfire but other than that I have absolutely everything and even the single pieces I have absolutely everything and again this is just my opinion so don't roast me on my opinion I'm just kidding you can just put in the comments what you think I left out or what is your favorites. So let's start with some honorable mentions, man. This was really hard to narrow down. I got it down to like 17, I guess, that I really liked and I couldn't necessarily decide. But the honorable mentions are not in any order. We're just going to go in alphabetical. First one, world's deadliest for Deadshot, super clean man, love the armor, love the target on the front, really like the chest piece, this is probably my favorite uh, helmet or whatever he has, and then his handguns, everything around his hand cannons, looked pretty smooth. Dr. Fate's the finery of order, Dr. Fate has a lot of ridiculous looking armor pieces and helmets, but all of these pieces in this gear set I love and it looks really good. Not too much on his arms or legs or chest, and his helmet looks amazing. Black Adam's royal garb of conduct. Not that he needs all of this armor, but I think it looks really good. And his headpiece with that little armor piece that comes down beside his cheeks look awesome. Even the pieces like on his legs and his shoulders, even though it's Black Adam and he definitely doesn't need all that stuff, uh, still looks good. Black Manta's Death of a Prince. I absolutely love his helmet in this gear set. And I guess if the rest of his gear set just had a little bit more, I think it would definitely make the top 10. But his helmet and his little jetpack in the back look absolutely awesome. And his little, even even his arms look pretty good. And then Harley Quinn actually has two honorable mentions. Her first one is Hot in the City. Now, um, I don't know. I couldn't decide between the two which ones to put in. And I love them both. This one, obviously, a lot less uh, pieces, a lot less grenades and, and holsters and straps and all that stuff, which makes it look super clean. And I absolutely love the headphones. And then we got the Harley Quinn Romance, which does have the helmet, the grenade, the straps, everything, the little uh, stun grenades. All of that stuff all around her looks amazing. I have a little bat symbol on her jacket. This looks really good too. And then last of the honorable mentions is Batman's billionaire suit. This one could actually probably be argued to be, at least for me, in the top five. But I didn't want to include, not to spoil anything, but I didn't want to include two Batmans in the top five. Even though this is absolutely amazing. Batman probably has the best suits the most suits and uh yeah this one looks really really good so let's officially begin this list we got number 10 atrocitus the five inversions when this set came out i was absolutely in love with it i love the little glow all of the shaders look so amazing his armor i love how the headpiece goes down over his eyes the horns everything man this is definitely atrocitus's best looking gear set and obviously in the top 10 just making it in at the 10 spot number nine uh, poison ivy fruits of crime now a lot of poison ivy's gear sets look ridiculous i mean to me anyway there's just too much to a lot of her gear sets but this one makes her look so elegant and uh, seductress like and really like appeal. I mean, she looks really good in this stuff. She doesn't have so many flowers all around her arm or chest and petals flying everywhere. It's just really simple, which I really like. Number eight, we got Raiden's Shinnok Imprisoned. 
This is amazing. Now, it was really, really hard for me not to bump this up to like the six or the seven. I kept going back and forth and almost from like this point forward, uh, it's gonna really depend on the day for you to tell me like which one I like more than others. Out of all of the characters ahead of this and all the gear sets, Raiden is probably the one I played the least, but I absolutely love this gear set. Just the way that it looks, especially with like the god shaders on there, his eyes, his hat, his armor, his, his arms, everything looks amazing. Number seven, we got Red Hood's Outlaws. And I mean, I, I don't know how you can't look at this gear set and be like, dang, that looks really, really clean. Especially with this shader on there, the Electrum, when this, uh, when Red Hood came out with this shader on there, you just had to pick this up, man. This looks so clean. Even the tournament shader looks really good. That's, you know, the one with all gold. But uh, yeah, I love the hood over his head, full facial mask. Uh, shoulders the silver looks really good with the white and the chest plate underneath it number six we got Catwoman's Gotham underground now I tell you when I first started trying to get this these gear sets put together this was the one I wanted more than anything and it took me so long to get it like trying to grind to get these pieces for this Catwoman gear set was almost what pushed me to try to do it every single day open thousands and thousands of mother boxes just to get this thing and uh has the nth metal shader on there a lot of these that you have to pay those gems for or crystals for certainly are worth it the purple looks amazing on her the mask those big huge cat eyes and the little skin tight outfit with her boots and uh, got the little claws on the end of her high heels purple whip and everything number five we got blue beetles game show danger this is probably my favorite character to play firestorm was the original character that i learned how to play injustice 2 on but Blue Beetle is probably my favorite absolute character to play and uh, absolutely love this gear set. I tried not to be biased because I could have very easily put this at number one as much as I played with this gear set and this shader on there. Jaime's uh, phase purple, shiny, glowy. I mean the antennas on his uh, headpiece, the little beetle on the back, the scarab looks so good dude i absolutely love this this thing looks amazing number four we got wonder woman's fabled heroine of themyscira or basically the movie gear set and yeah once they announced this was like the first gear set that they announced in injustice 2 that was like an additional gear set this didn't come out with the game it came out like as a special gear set a little bit later and when I saw this, man, absolutely in love, been in love with it the whole time. The Wonder Wo Woman movie, the outfit in the Wonder Woman movie looks so good. And then they put it in the game and did an absolute fantastic job with replicating it. Number three, we got Green Arrow's The Kill Machine. And this does have that, uh, that green arrow, lime green looking, emerald green looking, nth metal shader which is amazing absolutely amazing green arrow has some really good shaders and with this gear set it makes it look a million times better just the shine of the green and how bright the green is and the full armor piece the hood over his head all of the gold plating everywhere the gold plating around his uh, little arrow carrier quiver in the back and his bow man very very clean number two we got scarecrows the scare beast now i do not know how you can't absolutely love this gear set just just the fact of how different it is compared to everybody else's gear set i mean like how it taps into that like demon world and and mystic type of stuff with this headpiece the glowing eyes underneath it the little scare beast arms and head and his sickle and and man the chains around his leg the flowing uh cape in the back man i don't even know how to describe all this stuff but uh this one 
amazing. I almost put this at number one, but then again, I almost put Blue Beetles and Green Arrows. I wanted to put all of them at number one, all, all tied at number one, but still. And number one, we got Batman, The Beginnings. I'm sure you probably could have figured it out from the very beginning or from, you know, when I was going through the honorable mentions that I said, you know, there's going to be another Batman in the top five. And uh, yeah, I got the tournament gold shader on there. I really didn't even play Batman all that much. I mean, he was probably one of the easiest characters, I guess, to play and combo with besides for like Superman. But um, I don't know, man, this shader or this, this gear set just looks so good with the chest piece, his helmet, the eyes, how it just like arrows off to the side big huge top part the blades on his arms man he just looks like an absolute beast just the way he's standing and it's with his chest out and he just looks like dude i'm the king of gotham there is not a single person that can mess with me dude this is probably you know i think the best gear set in the game but then again, you know, it just depends on the day. I could go with any of them in the top five. Sometimes even the top seven or eight, I think, could be debated just depending on what day it is. But anyways, guys, that is going to do it. That is my top ten and my honorable mentions for the best gear sets in the game. Y'all have to let me know what you think. Did I leave any out? What would you put at number one? What is your favorite? Obviously, you know, if you have a favorite character, you might say that is your favorite gear piece. Or gear set but uh i don't know try not to be biased be objective you know um i didn't play much batman and i still think that that one might be the best but anyways thanks for watching if you're new to the channel hit the thumbs up we're gonna try to i'm gonna do my best to get back into the regular thing and um probably start streaming on twitch a lot more so if you're not following on twitch it's in the description i will see y'all again soon y'all take it easy i am out peace